champion, the left-handed Spaniard, Carolina Marin. Up against the number eight seed, Wang Yihan. sensation this young lady caused last year in Copenhagen winning the world title beating the Olympic champion Li Shue in the final first European to win the world women's singles title for 15 years first ever Spaniard to win a world championship medal and the first ever left-hander in the women's singles and green or black? black? Black. Green. Yes, sir. Service. Yes, sir. Thank you. No, I'm surprised that players choosing serve rather than men's when we've clearly seen earlier today that there is a bit of a drift in this arena. title in Wembley in 2011. There she is, the 27-year-old from Shanghai. Has been world number one. Total of 118 weeks as world number one. Win loss record for the year, translating into five previous tournaments. And a couple of semi-finals, three quarter-finals. All five tournaments, she's lost to the eventual beaten finalist. So to her opponent, the number three seed, Carolina Marin. 21 years of age, turns 22 next month. Lives in Madrid and was beaten finalist here last year, losing out to Simon Abel. And a year ago here in Sydney was the first ever Super Series tournament final that she had reached. Little did we know what she was going to go on to achieve after that. And when you look at her record this year already, the world champion, five tournaments, four finals, winning two of them. The All England Championships and the Malaysian Super Series. So as you can see, this is the fourth meeting between these two players. The last time they met was indeed in those world championships where Carolina Marin went on to take the gold medal. Oh my goodness, it was a thumping last time they played, nine and 12. Ready to play? No, the young fellow Richard Ramley from New Zealand, asking the players to get ready to play. Chris Yip from Hong Kong is our service judge. Well, Steen, I know you had a bit of an inside track to what was happening at the World Championships last year because I know you're good friends with Carolina Marin's coach and I know that they had studied Wang Yihan, this lady, in great detail to know how to play against her. Yeah, they did. They had a lot of her matches uh, on videotape and had uh, sort of uh, done some clipping, so they had... Um so I've got her playing, not only her playing style, but her habit strokes covered, and, and she was actually, um, uh, Carolina, Ladies and gentlemen, practicing footwork to watch my right, video from um, Wang Yihan, some of her opponents. So, um, very clever practice on my from uh, the Spanish Carolina team. Carolina Marin, Spain. Carolina Marin to serve. I remember. Level. Watching that match, Play. I thought, wow, is she, is she injured one of you home or something? Because she was totally outplayed. Yeah. I remember being stunned by it as well. Well, I'm about to find out if Wang Yi Han has won from that last experience. So it's over. One. Love. Not only a former world champion, not a former world number one, Wang Yihan, but Olympic silver medalist as well in London 2012. Oh, she's overdone it. 
to love. And of course, the whole scenario is so different now, isn't it, to when they last met at the World Championships. The whole scenario is so different from this Australian Open a year ago because all of a sudden now everybody's studying Carolina Marin. Yeah. Everybody's analysing her game. She's under pressure. She's expected to win the whole time because she's world champion. Yeah. Perhaps, but, but uh, I actually thought after she became the world champion, I thought that that might go quite a while before she won another tournament. And that was so wrong because she yeah. won uh, quite quickly afterwards. She had a... She suffered an injury One. in the second round of the world Two. championships where she slipped and, and hurt her left foot. And that sort of um, bothered her for a couple of months after the world's... But uh, then she came back here and, and has been playing great this uh, f uh, spring here. Won the two Premier Super Series of the year so far, so she's continued to, to surprise two. me. All. Yes, and as reigning All England World and European Champion, Really outstanding achievement from Carolina Murray. It's over. Three, two. It's over. Three, all. She touched the net before the shuttle came over. Wang Yihan. Four, three. Yeah, that's good umpiring. Sharp umpiring. What a net shot she played, though. Yeah, touched the net in trying to play the kill. Did you? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Very good umpiring. language of Wang Yihan is <laughs> is a little concerning if you're a Chinese yeah. fan. I was just thinking about it because um, Seven, seven. We've seen all these young Four, uh, female five. talented badminton players come up in the last couple of years and, and uh, sort of challenging the Chinese dominance and uh, one of the things that I notice about Colina Marini is that she's so strong physically. The way I see it, she's actually stronger than the Chinese. And, and that's the turn of the tables. Yeah. That they are not the dominant force in the physical part of the game. Look at that. Yeah. And that's possible because of the speed of movement. Yeah. Yeah. Six. So. Four. Combined with that, Colina Marini is an attacking player, and that means that. Uh, it, it, it's, it's hard to beat her in some way. In some way, you can't beat her. You have to make her beat herself. And that's a little bit um, <laughs> misleading, perhaps, but, but that's not the way to do it. That's not the way Wang Yihan Seven, is trying to create her own points, four. and it's going to go into disaster for her. The way to do it is, to, in my opinion, really? to try to get so much back that Carolina eventually overdoes her own shots. But that's more easier said than done. Yeah. Eight. 
I felt she Four. put in one punch clear too many there, Wamming Ihan. I thought she'd got her opponent out of position. Yeah. That one there, I yeah. think here she should have really gone for the winner. Yeah, or perhaps just, just played it safe and make sure that she didn't make a, a mistake. I was never one for safety. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a super shot, isn't it? I don't Nine, think Ian has the speed four. today to um, to match Caroline Marin. Seven of the last eight points to this lady. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Ten. Four. Look how fast she was in that yeah. third shot, Carolina Marine. She knew Eleven, what was coming. Four, well, nine of the last ten points now. That is extraordinary, isn't it? There, her coach, Fernando Rivas. What an incredible job he's done developing the player. From a country that doesn't have a tradition in the sport of badminton. Yeah, he's, he's a fantastic coach. Uh, working together with uh, Dane Anas Thompson in Madrid. And They're absolutely transformed standing in front of that the other evening. Watching this, it's just remarkable how they do that. Playing. Sign of confidence for uh, Carolina because that's not a 13, five. natural shot for her. It's very, very good, this one. What do you mean that's not natural? To play the, the reverse slice for a yeah, left hand? Yeah, yeah she, has, she has it grip twisted a little bit towards the backhand grip, and that makes that shot really difficult. But she's been practicing it hard and of course, uh, using it in game is easier when you feel confident, and that's probably how she feels right now. When she's a little bit under pressure, I suspect she won't be using 14, it that much. Mm -hmm. five. Well, already there's signs to me that Wang Yi Han mm -hmm. is running out of ideas. Yeah. And that's. Um, that's remarkable also in terms of Olympic qualification because yeah. if I were the Chinese um, 15, head of sports, five. would I select Wang Yihan to play the Olympics um, after performing like this against um, one of the top players of the world in the mo at the moment? I, I could see a player like Sun Yu 
yeah. participating at the Olympics together with Li Shiru. I see Li Shiru as, um, as uh, more or less automatic. Reigning Olympic champion. And this is where I feel that Wang Yihan might as well try something completely different because what she's done so far isn't working. And, and she needs to come up with something uh, in order to figure out how to beat this uh, Spanish player. So, so let's try something new. She was so close to the net there, Colina. Yeah, there it is again. Yeah. That same shot you were yeah. talking about. And, and that makes it really Zara. hard because Wang Yihan needs to cover both that cross-court shot and the straight smash, which is really, really powerful. Oh, there's a challenge here. Carolina it's Marin challenges. Called in. Called in. Yeah, Carolina Marin thinks it was out. Walker yeah, okay, will tell us for sure. She was awfully quick to make the challenge, which suggests that she's pretty confident that the incorrect call was made. Our instant review system. Ooh. What, a, what a great challenge. Correction out. Seventeen, six. Oh, we done it. Eighteen, six. Two, three down. She was Carolina Marin. I suspect we'd have this situation. Subsoba. I really, I mean, I posed Seven. the question, Steen. I, I said to you, what, what has Wang Yihan learned from that last experience when they played? And the answer is, at the moment, not a lot. And she's learned that she's number two in that match right now. Subsoba. Yeah. 19. Seven. Of course, we never know what happens when when the two players change the ends. But uh, right now, Wang Yihan is looking like she wants out of this court as quickly as possible. That's a feeling you sometimes get when it's not fun being in there mm. anymore. Yeah, look Twenty. At the whole body language. Yeah. Game point. If this was a, a practice situation, practice match, then we'd be calling for two against one instead of uh, one against one. Yeah. Because it's too easy. But let's see what yeah. happens in the second game. Another point required, though, for the first. Performance. First game won by Carolina Marin, 21-7. 21-7. Just 14 minutes of play. No, oh, that was phenomenal. Totally, totally dominant.
It really is glorious, isn't it? The sandy beaches. The sea and the surf. Job half done as far as Carolina Marin is concerned. Oh my goodness, how did she dig herself out of that? Good start for her. What you have? Really, what she needed. Yeah, and she does need it because it was just going through my mind, Steen. What if she went four or five points behind? Then I think psychologically she'd be broken. Yeah. I still think she's going to go four or five points behind the way she walks around court here because she doesn't seem like she has this um, mental energy to to come back. But uh, hopefully, hopefully I'm wrong because it'd be nice to see. Uh, a long and exciting match between Love. these two players. Yeah. Three. Love. Oh, she made a good start to the first game, did Wangi Han, but couldn't continue it on. Four development path Love. that Carolina Marin has taken. You know, I'm looking at her early tournament wins, her first title as a 16-year-old Irish international, played the international circuit for a number of years, Cyprus, Uganda, Spanish, Morocco, Swedish, whereas the first ever title that Wang Yi Han won was One. a super series title for <laughs> Japan. Four. You know, but I, I quite like the idea of coming up through the ranks of the International Series, then the Grand Prix Series, and then the Grand Prix Golds, then move into Super Series. But what's so staggering is that it was only a year ago that Carolina Marin, here in Australia, reached her first ever Super Series tournament final. And she was unseeded. Yeah. And here she is a, a year later. It, I mean, you wouldn't be able to script an improvement path like that. No. And until the uh, the final here last year in Australia, she'd only been in one quarterfinal at the Super Series level. So, so um, yeah. I think actually it's a uh, quite natural um, development that suddenly the things that you've worked on start to come together. Um, and, and I also think that it's been important to overcome this sort of um, small country syndrome. Too much delay, too much walking around. Stay on the court, ready to play. Yeah, well, good on playing there from uh, Richard Bramley. Yeah, because that was actually starting to time the, the time in between the rallies because I thought they were taking quite a long time before starting the new rally, so. Yeah, and certainly Carolina Marin doesn't need to take time because as you were pointing out earlier, Seven. she's physically probably the most, Five. the strongest player in, in the women's singles yeah. game. But if I were Wang Yihan, I would take as much time as I could in order to slow down the game and to sort of interrupt the rhythm of um, Marin. I've seen a little bit of effect of the uh, change of ends. It's not 
so easy to push the shots for Carolina Marina as it was in the in the first game. What a good rally. It's over. Three. Five. Thirty one shots. It's great judgment. Long and wide. It's over. Six. Three. Interesting. Seven. Mm. Three. Flat serve, almost a flick. What, really inviting the attacking play? Yeah. It's hard to uh, to sort of punch the clear. So, well, you can it's over. Four. concentrate on Seven. the front court. She's already made more mistakes in this uh, second game, Carolina Marin, than she did in the whole first game. Marin's going to have to be careful here because having made the error didn't hand the shuttle back immediately turned her back on the net and walked away and had a word with her coach at the back of the court now that's the sort of situation that got into such trouble in the final of the German Grand Prix gold the red cards which is deducted points Ten, in Germany. Four. Yeah. Eleven, four. Very good ball. second game from uh, Wang Yihan. He's taking advantage of the playing against the drift and uh, forced Carolina Marin to make some errors because she's uncertain on what to do. Well, it's really amazing that the drift can have such an influence on the game. Oh, that's a great 
incredible shot yeah. from Wiley and Hahn. Yeah, no, so she played a backhand winner from, from this position. Look at this. 12. I, mean, I think actually uh, <laughs> Carolina is, uh, is starting to beat herself because she's trying to play the same kind of style that she played in the first game, that powerful, quick, fast-paced game. And uh, a good smash here, but, but she needs to be more patient on this side. Five. She can still play fast, Twelve. Uh, but she can't be as powerful as in, uh, in the first game. So um, that's actually what she needs to change. A bit more patient on the rally. It's over. Well, I honestly 15, felt five. after the opening game and the first couple of rallies of this second game, I thought Wang Yi Han was just about ready to give up on it. I mean, she looked as if she was out of ideas, Wait. out of sorts. But Delighted to say that she proved me wrong. Subsiva, six, of the head there from Carolina six Marin. Over. 14, six. Well, this is the fascination of sport, isn't it? That things can turn away around so dramatically. It's over. Seven, fourteen. First women's singles this afternoon, you were talking about follow up with Wang Shoshian. <laughs> That's the sort of follow up that you were talking about. <laughs> That's it. That's exactly it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what? This second game is far from over. Nine. Fourteen. I think it's definitely a strategy from uh, Wang Yang to, to make long breaks. Wang. Ready. Yeah, the young part's alert to it, though, isn't he? Oh. Yeah, that's well played. That's well played. And she's coming much quicker to the front court Wang Yihan when she's returned a shot from the back court. 15, she's really quick to the nine. front court because she knows that the probability of getting under pressure herself on, on the back court is very, very little. Good shot. Excellent return from Marie. The first time Yuhan tried that flick 15. serve, she sort of uh, outplayed herself this time. Much more clever shot. Eleven. 
often think the 15. the smash or the push directly at Wani Han is very effective. Yeah. And she's very good out wide defending, not so when it's pushed to her body. Your point, Joe. Yeah. 12. And I think often 15. the attacking players, what they have on this follow up is that they're not afraid to leave the backcourt open. Yeah. And then once in a while, of course, the opponent will be able to defend long and you will look stupid, but all the other times you will win easy points. This is extraordinary, isn't it? Just two points in it now. 13. One time, eight point difference. In fact, she just won seven of the last eight points. 6.14 down she was. Phenomenal comeback. And the problem for Wang Yihan is that it's again 14. now Carolina Marine who's 15. controlling the rallies. So she's adjusted her game. Play. So from down 11 4, it's now 10 4. Marine. <laughs> 11 for main court. Yeah, since that we've gone in for. 15. Oh. Extraordinary. to an end. That's six straight so over. 16. 15. Carolina, ready. That is impressive. It's over. 16. All. Oh. Speed of movement, speed of thought, speed of shot. That's well played. Yeah. There is the body smash again, Joe. Yeah. 17. Have you seen this 16. match before? <laughs> well, you've seen matches with uh, Wang Yihan before. Yeah, I certainly have. Enjoyed watching her for years. And this is the first time in this second game that the world champion has gone into the lead. I'll just check back. Sure, it was one point. It was a nine-point deficit. Oh. 
Well, it's over. Seven good pressure eight. play from Wang Yi Hun. Four. Players ready. Well, players ready. One player is already ready to return. There's one player not ready to serve. Oh. Yeah, there's the the body attack again. She apologizes for hitting her opponent. Seventeen. One out wide, then to the to the body. is just extraordinary. 19, 17. Carolina. How did she get back that net cord? She didn't just get it back, she got it back with interest. That is phenomenal. So you had there. Yeah. 20. Match the point. Yell 18. From Carolina Marin. The celebrations indicate that she's got two match point opportunities. Phenomenal comeback by the European and world champion Carolina Marin. Nine points adrift at 4.13 down in the second game. She'd storm through the first 21-7. But to come back and take that second game, 21-18. Yeah, thanks to coach Fernando Rivas. But that is an extraordinary performance from Carolina Marin. <laughs> yeah, well played. Oh, she'll be absolutely delighted with that. And she will play either the Olympic champion, Li Shui Rei, or Sung Ji Hyun of Korea in tomorrow's semi-final.
waiting for your signal. Uh, I'm waiting for your signal.